welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. Today I'm going to be doing a my story. The holiday vacation that um, I went on, um, to Lanzarote Airport. Let's jump right into it. Now what I can remember that operator is no longer running anything because the operator went bust and it was um, somewhere at the time had a monarch airlines but um, we had um, a british and um then an air bus basically about the size Seven three seven aircraft, and it uh, went from East Midlands, and it was British and at to uh, Lanzarote, Arizona for airport, and for fourteen days we were supposed to be staying in the Kizzy apartment, but because we they basically they gave us two options which was uh, and it was only like a day before we were supposed to travel which again was really bad lights kept changing a few times as well different days different days. um for what i can remember um we had um an flight and got there at night um at uh, the this is all apartments and um, the not it wasn't the tigisol we should have stayed in the tigisol but to stay in the ta tabitha apartment we had the choice of the tabitha apartment or the player hotel um if we wanted to go in the player black hotel they have to pay more money out um so we were supposed to be staying somewhere else for sara apartments to take you but that was downgraded to two star apartments called the tab um was near a water park but it was miles away from a shop a beach and um, there were like a shop on ice and two small swimming pools it have karaoke live music has entertainment um, again not really special there was a pool table well um but again not really anything special um for kids section i think of poles or a pole which is like a paddle or where they can play younger children but again there wasn't really a Still, um, I was going to go to the water park up, so um, I didn't go and um, again the apartments size, the actual size of the apartments were uh, quite high. I only had two cooking rings and it was a uh, Thought Costa de Gizzi expensive eat out. Um, in the fortnight, we only ate about three times. One from the day we had a apartment restaurant and take we had a pizza. Um, the first night 
Uh, we had uh, something to um, eat, so it it was we only ate out three nights in the because it was just so expensive to eat. Out. Um, So um, the shop site only really carried basic guitar and probably um, some like on bands and to and probably like chewing gum and sweets. Um, so I think it was only like the really market at the time. Um, and thank goodness we had a bar. Um, we had a car for seven days um, and we went to um, a library that sort in our opinion of Porta del Car. It had a beautiful sandy beach and you know quite a bit to do. Um, excuse me, I can't get rid of this car. And yes, um, when other resorts, um, so, uh, so um, yes, um, I mean, um, could go on excursions, but again, we had to pay that extra to go on that excursion. So I um, decided to just hire a car. It would be cheaper in the end, and plus that to see some half the locations um, on the island. Um, so yes, um, as again the apartment. Mum and did have a separate room, and Sarah and I had the same room. It was like a fold up for bed, um, basically, that we had to get out. Um, so, like, you had the majority of time, had table and chair. Um, Again, um, I came in about uh, twice or to clean the apartment, um, but um, again, um, it be like um, we'd have to own breakfast and uh, maybe lunch as well and dinner if we unless we like so I mean, mum went to to the supermarket and it's just cheaper to do that um, and we did a one um cereal in our suitcase is what food could take uh, with us and obviously food like milk and say cheese we couldn't basically take with us oh. um, obviously we had to be on site like um But um, none of us really thought it was a very good holiday, really. Um, it was also, I thought we had cockroaches um, in the toilet. And it just it wasn't very nice at all. And the beach wasn't that good. 
too far um to really a lot to do to play golf or go in the water park beach again that pretty far i mean on water sports for beach again it was a long way right because we like at right back of the resort away from like all the shops and other facilities um again um all the restaurants were a lot of a lot of the time on the beach front and in on Saint Hart saying we was away um so again we had like big walk um, and from what I remember, um, so um, I'm trying to think of all the that uh, we went to all the resorts, and it seemed some sites on the island um, over to the north side um, of the Lanzarote Island it's completely different um, again even in the time it looked basically looked like somewhere in England like um, Star Devon side of the island and the north side of the island was a lot cooler and the south side of where we basically had beautiful weather, weather but, and it was like this very island so yes went over to the side and um quite a few times actually um taking pictures basically and uh, we went to Port Carmen one day as well. Um, so it's so yeah. Um, so yes, at the it's an awful lot of sorts on. Um, was a uh, player from Porta del Carm, player Lickos, and Costa at Tessie. So it's only really about sports to choose from at the time. The main resorts across the game player Blanca del Carmen. Um, um, if you want to get to your daughter on an expedition to the glorious island, um, if you want to, um, or Morocco, North Africa, but again, it's quite expensive to go to uh, places. Um, with Morocco, if we were planning to go down, have to take injections but that's that injections, but basically it would it would be advisable anyway maybe extra again it it would have worked out a lot more expensive for with their family holidays so, and that's what we decided to hire a car um, because we just we could sell really um, so now the offer free blanket experts but we wasn't offered the free experts so obviously we, we couldn't go on it because it wasn't offered it like 
um, thank you for watching please like and subscribe um, if you haven't already done so and I'll see you in my next travel video uh, which is going to be tomorrow and it's, it's going to be travel news so please keep watching that. other thing that I wanted to add on my story um, with British Mills um, on the way back um, Mother Kate got sent to Manchester Airport in East Midlands. So, um, on the whole, I did claim back a couple of hundred pounds, which was at least about £360. But we did want to claim back more than we couldn't do. Um, so, watching um i love you all and i'll see you in my next travel video which is tomorrow bye thank you bye